I'm Brenda Cadera. I'm a contemporary realist painter and I work in oil, watercolor, and acrylic. My inspiration for this painting is my lily pond. We have several lily ponds and over the years we've built several more. I have, paint, I have lily ponds inside the house and outside the house and they're a great source of um, tranquility, which is the name for this painting, and enjoyment. Just watching the fish, watching the, the lilies grow, we have lotus. Um, it's just a really beautiful thing to look at and the, just the sound of the flowing water is just very tranquil and, and wonderful. I decided to do this painting in oil because there were certain things about the medium that I wanted to learn for this particular, in this particular painting. Um, I work in uh, acrylic and watercolor as well. I've been a watercolorist for many years, but in this particular painting I wanted to do it in oil because I, um, it was a great study in green. And the really neat thing about this painting is the fact that it has very, very little green paint in it. So 95% of the greens in this painting were made by using mixtures of blue, different blues, different yellows, and some of the other colors that are in the painting. So my painting process for my oil painting um, involves basically painting the entire painting twice. I paint the whole painting, everything is all blocked in. That way I kind of get an overall view of what the final painting is going to look like. Then I make the decision, well, I don't want that flower, I don't want that fish, uh, those bubbles are in the wrong place, I need to add bubbles here. Where do I want to put that dragonfly? Where is it going to show up? So every time I eliminate or add something, I have to think about um, if something is added with a different light source, I have to make the light source fit everything else that's in the painting. If I eliminate a lily pad or a flower, I have to think about where the shadows are going to be now. So as a realist painter, I have to be accountable for the realism and the detail that's in it. So there's a lot of thought that goes into um, the composition and the accuracy of the painting as I go along. So a lot of changes are made along the way. I, I change the values, the lightness or darkness of a um, color so that um, objects show up more or less next to each other. Obviously objects that are similar in value are not going to show up as much as a really strong contrasty area like the uh, lilies against the dark shadows that are underneath them or the bright light fish against the dark water next to them. So those are some of the decisions I make throughout the process. This painting traveled the U.S. It went to four different museums including the Hiram Blauvelt Museum and the Kenosha Museum. The Tranquility series, which I painted several years ago, uh, is available on my website. I have the original painting is available, and I also have prints, G. Clay prints. Um, they're very high-end, wonderful archival prints that are um, on canvas. The best way to reach me is through KaderaFineArt.com, or you can reach me through my new YouTube channel, Brenda Kadera Fine Art.